Hello, John Dilworth here. Uh, we're going to do this scene. This scene, 19A, is a tent shot. And Jim looks out. So that's what we're going to do. Uh, uh, so, so, it's never so. It is what it is. We do it. There's our field. Right, right, right. So, inkers, how do we find inkers, right? Well, I did it, I did it kind of simple way. There was a university a school, yeah, well, there's a university doing their, well, come and meet the graduates of a cartooning and illustration class. And so I went and I met every single artist there, every, everyone looked at their work, chatted with those that, to me, I felt was more, were more promising for what we needed to do, of course, because we're casting. It's about casting, I learned. Casting, casting talent. Everybody has their abilities and contributions, right? And I'm just looking at what I need, and I need good inkers. I need inkers who can ink digitally. And this is, this is our little tent going back somewhat in the distance. Does that look? Yeah, it's a little off. I don't like that. Woohoo! So what do we got to do? What we have to do? We have to in raise it. That's, and that's all. Is there fun with these colored pencils? I love colored pencils. You just do things with it. You can, you know, look, so not much has changed. I can, I can move this here and right and i just do this i was getting a big laugh thinking about that old warner brothers cartoon oh, i don't even know the name of it i could ask jerry back he'll tell me right away the little little red riding hood something like that it's not texas little hot riding hood that's awesome i couldn't believe that that's just crazy that's it that's those are gems those are the real gems, like seven, seven, what is it, coal black and the, and the seven dwarfs? Amazing, amazing. Of course, today we have troubles. We can't show that cartoon. Amazing. Really, if you wanted to, so that I feel better. There's, there's everything. And so that's really easy. So, uh, you know, it's, it's that, but bigger. That's my layout, right? And then, this is what animators do, so put up with it, right? All the animators out there. What I'm going to do next is going to be fascinating for me, too, because I don't know. Well, let me see. Oh, they're coming for me. So sorry. I'm over here. Come on up. I'll just buzz. You got the jacket? No, I guess it's not for me. They're going for somebody else first. So this hand, so you see, this is, this is what I'm thinking. Jim comes out of the tent, right? And he's got, what has he got? Five, ten. Oh, that's, that's the tent. That's the tent length. And then he comes out, and then is he held? Wait a minute, where's scene 20? Is this 20? Yeah. So the tent, and then he comes out. So a little, a little bounce, right? We get, I don't know how many seconds you need, 16. What is this? This is five, ten, ha ha ha! Well, it could be sixteen, right? So anyway, it's that. That's that, right? That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna hold that. Then he's gonna come out. Maybe I'll have him come out, bridge it, just so he settles around here. Because this is what I'm thinking. You know, he comes out like this, but I don't want him to come out like that. It's so boring, right? Maybe one hand, the left, the the left then the right, I mean, even by a two frames difference. And then his head, I'm thinking, would come down like a curve, like that. Am I drawing off camera, like a dum-dum? I have no idea if I'm drawing off camera. Well, you should look. Ah! All right, I'll tell you what, I'll do it again. I was thinking, what if his hand opened one side of the curtain first, right? And then, followed by four frames later, this cat, maybe two frames later, four. Four is good. 
and then you see his head curve upward like that I think that at least to me would be very interesting to see the least yeah and then you could uh, yeah it's it's helpful just to do to, to sketch it out see how it feels right this is how we do it anyway so I don't need to tell the real pros in the in the YouTube universe how this is going to work out because we're fortune tellers we can see it right and there is his hair his hair ha <laughs> ha his hair and his little skinny I'm only now getting a feel for this guy's anatomy I mean look how skinny his I don't you know this is gonna be skinny if we're gonna keep on model right right and then this arm is gonna be here so his hand is here this one there so I've got you know this dynamics going on maybe it's not noticed by everybody right away because there's a short sceney sceney but I tell you there's stuff going on so that's what I'm gonna animate and um, until then right you stay animated